Let's interpret a given exponential model. So say a friend is using the equation p of t equals 4600 times 1.072 raised to the power of t to predict the annual tuition at a local college. If the formula is based on years after 2010, meaning that 2010 is considered to be year zero, what does the equation tell us? Let's start by comparing this to the general exponential model. We notice that it's exponential because the t is an exponent. And again, the general exponential model looks like this. Matching up the pieces, it's clear that the initial value is 4600. And what's in parentheses, 1 plus r equals 1.072. So r must be 0 0.072, or 7.2%. Interpreting these, the cost in year 0 or the cost in the initial year, which is 2010, was 4,600. So we conclude that the tuition in 2010 was $4,600 a year. And the fact that R is 7.2% tells us that the growth rate is that 7.2%. So the tuition at that college is growing by about 7.2% each year.